My name is Mike Randolph and I'm the proud principal of Leesburg High School and we are so proud to partner with the anti-bullying program here for our Jacket family. The anti-bullying program has helped our Leesburg High School Jackets really transform our perception not only within our community but amongst our scholars as well. In 2017, our scholars possessed a 67% graduation rate and our scholars only earned 252 college credits through advanced placement courses. Fast forward seven years, in 2023, our scholars are projected to have a 90% graduation rate for the first time in our 98 year history and our scholars earned over 1,300 college credits through the Cambridge Advanced International Certificate of Education program. So again, we attribute that success to us building a better culture and a better environment for our scholars, and that's through our anti-bullying program and through our partnership with, that, with our anti-bullying program. As a result of our Pledge Against Bullying program, we have also created an atmosphere where we have been able to recruit and retain high quality teachers, as evident by our lack of turnover last year. Also, by partnering with our Pledge Against Bullying program, we have improved the number of scholars that are attending Leesburg High School. In 2017, our enrollment numbers were down to 1,250 scholars. This year, we are currently sitting at 1,735 scholars and growing. Again, that is because of the positive environment that we are creating for our scholars here at Leesburg High School. The biggest success piece of our anti-bullying program is the visibility, especially with the buttons that we use to really mark ourselves as standing up and taking a pledge against anti-bullying. So thank you, Mr. Vandeveld, and thank you, Chef Bell, for your guidance and vision for uh, starting this anti-bullying program here with our Jacket family. My name is Maya Peoples and I'm a junior at Leesburg High School. I am president of Interact and I feel a lot, like I feel super safe coming to school. My parents also feel safe for me coming to school. The learning environment here is really good and bullying is basically gone now. My name is uh, Chef John Bell. I am the culinary arts instructor at Leesburg High School in Leesburg, Florida. I'm also the uh, advisor for Interact here at Leesburg. This is my seventh year uh, overseeing Interact. I also am a club sponsor for SkillsUSA, and together the two clubs work hand in hand. But Interact uh, is a club that is dear to my heart because they connect with every city in the world. So that's one of the reasons I joined it. Um, and about six years ago, we started a, a, a something a little bit different. I was asked what could change the world a little bit and what kids could do the better things. And we talked about bullying. Uh, myself, personally, I was bullied as a child, so that was something dear to me. But when I was asked about it, my son was here at the school, and he's special needs. Lennon was bullied completely. Yeah. Literally no day went by where he wasn't crying the way people treated him as of his special needs. It broke my heart. So we wanted to try to do something to reach people like Lennon. So we started what's called the Bullying Pledge, and we use, as you can see, we have a lot of buttons here that kids have made, and they, they're inspired to just come up with new ways to reach others and talk to kids. In our high school, we've changed a lot. We've had a lot of violence in our school over the years. And in the last few years that we've done the anti-bullying, our violence has literally been cut by about 70%. Our graduation rate's gone up. Kids are more apt to talk to each other. Once we start each year with the new kids, when we introduce them to the bullying pledge, we do signings where all the kids in the school get to sign a banner saying that they take the pledge to help each other. Uh, some examples are incredible, like Lennon feels, when he graduated, he was voted uh, on the prom court because of people meeting him and getting to know him as a human being instead of just a kid with the needs that they didn't understand. I had a student named DeAsia that uh, was a, she was quite the bully herself. She caused a lot of trouble, had a lot of fights, and she started to get involved in it and started to change a little bit. And then, Right before her graduation, she came up and she spoke about a student that she saw quietly in the cafeteria and she just went up and talked to her and she said, what's going on? It was an Asian girl. She was actually Taiwanese. And she asked what was going on and the girl didn't say anything at first, but the Asian kept befriending her and just kept talking to her. The next day, the girl told her that she was thinking about killing herself 
and because DA should befriended her, she thought about it. That student now is in actually in nursing school, and DeAsia is also in nursing school, and they're friends to this day, and they rely on each other to get through school, and they're both juniors in college right now. They both have a 3.0. So the Bullying P Pledge Program has done tremendous things personally that I've seen in the school, but more importantly, it spreads, and other schools are starting to look at what we're doing, and we can change them as well.